Um, Simone has said, is it necessary to have scans before starting? No, it is not. Um, and there's a couple of reasons for that. There is nothing that's going to come back on the MRI if you are coming with back pain or sciatica. So if you have lower back pain, you struggle to do certain things. That's why the core five are such great things, because they're a test as well as the exercise. You can't perform those. And you've got back pain or buttock pain or pain down the leg. And you've been referred, or you're, there's consideration to refer for MRI. There is literally nothing that's going to come back on the MRI that means you don't need to do rehab. Yeah, but even in the worst case, and you had to have an emergency surgery, you still need to do the rehab. You still need to do the rehab. And so waiting until the scan is done in six months time or six weeks time makes no sense because you're still doing things every day. The difference is you can either do things while you're waiting for the scan that are going to help improve back health, or you can keep doing everything else you're doing every single day. And so that's the big rationale here. I do, I'm very, very for imaging. I really think it's so helpful, especially when it's done in the right sort of way. And that's why whenever we get members that share their images with us in the program, we go through and use them as a learning experience because they're so helpful. It's so insightful. It's so, we're so blessed to live in a time when you can actually get this information and have an intimate understanding. Like you can see it's so helpful, but it doesn't mean that you, you don't need to do the rehab. So it can embellish, it can help you, but it, it, it doesn't uh, change what you need to do.